So it is December 21st, 2021, and I'm having it. Okay, great. I'm having, I'm having my afternoon snack, and all I have here. It's a little funny, isn't it? I mean, I don't have any organic vegan cane sugar in the house today. The sweetened, let's say, the powdered peanut butter that I got in the living room with the coconut oil that remains in this jar here. I'm not sure if I'm going to mix some of this with the powdered peanut butter. I don't know yet. I also have uh, the creamy cashew butter here. This is vegan. Simple Mills organic frosting with coconut oil and chocolate. Let's see the um, powdered sugar, organic Dutch cocoa powder, organic coconut oil, tapioca starch, vanilla extract, rosemary extract, sea salt, monk fruit extract. Usually, um, things that are um, technically uh, possibly vegan can be narrowed down when they have a ingredient like monk fruit extract in there along with tapioca starch and um, I'm not sure if this is vegan actually I have to look, I'm going to look it up online to make sure Wait, it says right down here. Uh, oh, this is vegan. Look at that. I don't know if it's coming up on camera. Down. Let's see if it's right where my thumb is right here. Is it? I'm trying to get on camera. There. See in the yellow, it says vegan. It's good. Chocolate frost then. I might have like a teaspoon or a taste dust then. It's one of those things where it's like in the um the, the one scene in the movie Home Alone where he's eating the gallon of ice cream. The vegan ice cream that you buy at the store, um, they switched from, like I said, carrageenan to gel and gum, and I have trouble digesting that. I, some of the brands still use carrageenan or guer gum, I'm okay with that. But the one I have in the fridge used um, gel and gum, and I just can't. Good.